Hello everybody. We're doing a TRX which is all twisted and three-dimensional but full body training everything. Uh, we'll get started with the hands in the straps. So the TRX is mid-thigh length and we're going to stand facing the anchor point and we'll go into a squat and we're just going to stir here and circle. So jumping right into the three-dimensionality out of the sagittal, moving the body, warming it up, stretching the back, moving into the legs, feeling the feet grounded, activating your pelvic floor and abs, glutes, back extensors, lengthening through your neck, opening the shoulders, stretching your arms forward, and then go the other way. Keeping your kneecaps facing forward. Breathing through it. Check on your feet, spread your toes. Pull your abdominal wall into your back, nicely activating your abdominals. Four more, three, <clears throat> two, and one, and then just stretch one forward. And now roll through your spine and all the way up, hands up here. Now step the feet together and onto your heels, so lift the toes, and now you're gonna lean in and bend and then work the arms up, stretch your back and flip your toes to the other side, lean in, twist and come back up and flip. Making sure you're pulling the ribs in. And connect the ribs to your navel. Breathing through it. And one more. To each side. And then all the way down into a stretch. Rolling through. And then hold on to the handles. Go into squat and rotate one side open and to the other side open. Rotating, twisting into the upper back, keeping the pelvis stable pelvic floor, navel activity all the way through. Feel the axis between the tailbone and the top of the head. And then we'll have one more to each side. And then come up, lean in. And now we're gonna Bend one elbow and extend, pull back on the other side. And we're going to also twist slightly to the extended side. Feel obliques. 
feel bicep, just like a one-sided bicep hug. And upper back. Maybe you want to adjust the feet forward to make it more intense. Check on your feet and let the toes be alive and spread out without gripping. And check on abs and glutes. Last one here. And then we're gonna go straight into a row and an opening and other side this time you're going to keep your body straight forward though one arm is rowing other arm is pulling out and the rowing arm Pulling next to your rib cage, making sure you have an equal amount of tension on both straps so you don't have any sawing there. Breathing and scanning through your body so you can refresh the plank from the feet to the top of the head. Make sure you keep your neck aligned to the gaze towards the anchor point. One more time each side. And then just pull yourself up into a big twist. Bending one knee for a twist to the left and other knee twist to the right. And again, twist to the left. And twist to the right. And then bend equally and roll up into standing. And we're gonna have a side lunge with a slightly diagonal pull. And keep going to the same side. Tapping back, leaning in. Four more. Three. Two. And then hold it down and open and close and open and close. Leaning in to that right buttock, right side quads. Four, three, two, and one. And come up. Go straight into curtsy to just tap down, tap the right knee down into the floor. So now we're working the left leg. Tap down, so very deep curtsy, deep glute work, 
quads, hamstrings. And really burn out the left leg, left glutes. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And come up. We'll go into the left side now with the diagonal pull to the right. Four more. Three. Two. Hold it down here and open and close and open and close. Open, close. Four. Three. Two. And one. And come up. Going straight into curtsy, pulse the knee down, down, down. Working into the right leg, right glutes, right quads, hamstrings. Pulsing. Breathing. Working core, pelvic floor. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, coming up. Now we'll go into a bicep curl, but we're going to go slightly diagonal here with a twist. We'll have the bicep curl with some obliques, 10 on each side, maybe walking the feet in slightly to get some more resistance. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10, and then one to hold, and slowly transfer over to go onto the other side twist, and two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and release. Back to neutral, into a big stretch. Rolling up through your spine. And we're going to just turn around, go straight into the triceps. And we'll have that twist here again, <clears throat> including some nice obliques. Setting yourself up, leaning in. And we'll go one for a bend, and then one just the straight arms and bend and then straight arms forward. Tighten up that core.
Keep the shoulders far away from your ears. Lengthen through the top of the head. Keep your glutes firm, abs firm. Last two. Last one. And then bend, slowly switch and extend to go into the other side twist. Keep your shoulders square. And refresh your abs. Three more of each. Two. And one. And just come back, stretch out. And then all the way around your legs. And we'll do a back extension now with just one arm going back and coming forward. And we'll have the other arm. We'll bow and we'll come back. So basically, we're gonna bend our nose towards one knee and then out and towards the other knee and out. light on the TRX. So you want to work your back and glutes and not use the TRX as a support, but just as a guidance. Try to keep your pelvis in place though. And I am literally touching the knee with my nose. Last one each. And then one to just relax here. Slowly rolling up. And then lengthen the TRX to knee height. <clears throat> and we'll just have the left foot in. <clears throat> and we'll do a side lunge here going into a diagonal with the arms alternating, twisting in the upper body. You still want to sit far back. You want to get a stretch into your inner thigh here. <clears throat> And then stay lower to make it more intense. Ten. 
ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And come up. Let's just switch other side. <coughs> And settle in your side lunge situation. <clears throat> and then let's go to the left with the arms, to the right with a twist in the upper body. I have my standing leg just slightly turned up. Make sure your knee is on top of the foot. And start to go a little lower and not come up all the way anymore. <clears throat> Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, and one. Coming up and lengthen the TRX to a mid calf length. And we're going straight down with the feet in. Onto the right elbow and left hand. Lift your knees here. Extend out into the plank. And now do a pike with just a tiny little bit of a twist. It's barely anything, but as you're looking onto the left arm, left side, You'll have a little bit of left obliques there. It's really deep. I like the subtle obliques. Not too obvious, but really deep and connected. We'll have four more. Three, two, and one. Switch sides. Getting ready, lifting the knees, stretch out into plank, and pike. Last two. And release. Take a twist. And to the other side. And out of the straps. And sitting down. for our roll down. Let me just shorten this a little bit so I'm not gonna get too far back. Inhale here, exhale, rolling down. And now I'm barely touching and I'm coming up again and I'm gonna push to the right and I'm barely getting down to the bottom 
and roll up with a deep core activity that really keeps you coordinated and smooth so your back doesn't experience any pull, any sudden moves. Nice and slow. And we're gonna add on, coming up to extend. Extend and building some more flow. Making sure to connect the ribs to pull the abs in deep. Keep your pelvis stable in the center. And then hold it up. And pull into rotation. 10, 9, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, coming back and up onto the other side. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Rolling all the way down, all the way down. Now inhale. Exhale, coming up into a cross-legged, reaching forward and leaning over to the right side, feeling a nice stretch in the left side, but also glutes and leaning over to the left side. I hope this feels as good to you as it does to me. Try to make it your own. Try to make it fit your own body and then come back, rolling up through your body and then let go of the straps. Just feeling nice and tall, elongated, stretched out, work through. Take the arms up for a deep inhale to bring in all the good things, palms together, and then down through your midline, nice and centered and accomplished. Thank you for joining, well done.